Hi, everybody. This week, we're going to do the next movement in the Yang Cheng Fu's 13 original postures form, uh, which is play guitar. And first, let's go through the whole the whole form. And uh, just uh, I'll do it with my back to you and just kind of bring you kind of incorporate that. Just follow along as best you can. All right, here we go. So first, get your um, your three pillars in, feel the balls of your feet, knees are unlocked, reach with your the crown of your head, relax your lower back, reach with your elbows, reach with your fingers, and begin. Nice and slow.
Okay, let's uh, take a look at um, the play guitar. Play guitar. Here we go. So we're starting from uh, brush knee twist step. So your weight is in your left leg. Your left leg is a substantial leg. Your right leg is pretty straight. There's that your the line from your leg up your back. You want to keep that a straight line. Your spine is lined up with that back leg. Do the ball of the left foot. Set the left knee spiral down to the left, and reach out with your left hand with the thumb pointing down. You reach out. And thumb points down, the left palm is facing to the left. Both palms are facing to the left at this point here. Re released into that right leg or left leg. Now you feel the ball of the right foot, set the right knee and spiral down to the right. You're loading up the right quad, you're spiraling down. And as you do that, you're rotating both arms so both palms are facing to the right now. So you really load it up into that, that right leg, reaching out. You're reaching with that elbow, opening up the shoulder joint. Let's notice that the shoulder joint, the elbow is pretty much parallel with the shoulder, which if you try lifting your arm via the shoulder, then it's just gonna kink the hose there. You don't wanna do that. You want to reach with the elbow so that opens up the joint, allows the energy to move freely. And you're reaching out like this. It's almost like you're pulling back a bow. Both palms are facing to the right. And then you turn back to center and come in on the heel of your left foot. You're reaching with, uh, with both arms. The arms are parallel. Notice the line there and the left uh, right hand matches up with the left elbow. You're reaching out with that. So your weight is about 90% in the right leg, lightly on the heel of the left foot, reaching out with the with both hands. Okay, I'll do it facing you. The ball, set the left knee, spiral down to the left. The left hand reaches out. So you're reaching out and rotate the forearm so that both hands are, are facing out. Notice that the elbow is reaching out as well. So you're, you're reaching out like that and both hands are about pretty much even when they're going out. Your weight is um, in that left leg. Your left leg is a substantial leg. You're released down into that left quad. Now you're gonna feel the ball of the right foot, set the right knee and spiral down to the right. And as you turn, you're gonna rotate your forearm so that both palms are facing to the right. You feel released down into that right quad. And now you turn back to center. And as you do that, you pull your left foot back onto the heel and reach out with your fingers, reach out with your hands, set your elbows. Okay. And one more, the other side, we'll do it. Uh, one more look, here we go. So do the ball of the left foot, set the left knee, spiral down to the left, reach out with the left hand and rotate the forearm. Right ball, set the right knee, spiral down to the right. Rotate the forearms so that the palms are facing to the right. Right ball, set the right knee and turn back to center on the heel of the left foot, 
reach with both hands. And the key here is notice that the hands were not crossing the center line like this. The hands are parallel. I know in some forms there is this kind of thing going on. This one, we want to get the hands so that they're we're reaching straight ahead. Okay. The um, so they're parallel that that way. And we're also parallel this way. We don't want to drop this hand. We want them to be parallel this way as well. So that way you get your play guitar posture. Okay. Thank you all very much.